Hi, this is Cecilia from Tarot by Cecilia, and today is Sunday, October 2nd, 2022. The tarot card for today is the Ten of Wands, and this one is from my friend Joanna Nelson, and this is from her Whispering Spirits Tarot. Stay tuned because she does have another Kickstarter coming up this year, and it will be for the most adorable Lenormand deck. I think it's one of my favorite decks so far. First, I want to say happy Mercury Direct Day. Where I am in my time zone, Mercury will be direct at 5.07 a.m. But, but, there's a popular misconception out there about Mercury going direct. It's actually at its worst on the days that it stations retrograde and direct. So, you know, proceed with caution. This isn't the time to think you can run out and do everything. I would give it until at least probably the 7th if it's anything important. All right, just so you know that. Now, you know, it just occurred to me, like, it's only Sunday. It's only Sunday, and here we are with the Ten of Wands. And we only saw it a couple weeks ago, all right? You know, what have you got going on? This is This is a heavy load. This is a lot of responsibility, a lot to be done. You know, I think you can handle it. I really, truly do. Um, it may feel like a lot today. You do have the moon in your corner. It will be moving into Capricorn in the wee hours of the morning. And Capricorn's your workhorse, so Capricorn can handle this load. Then we have Mercury going direct. Then the moon's going to square Jupiter and Venus. Ah, yeah, it's just like... It might feel like the Mondayest of Sundays. I don't know. Does that make sense when I say that? All right. It is what it is. This is a card of responsibility, of burdens, of oppression. You know, you just feel, ugh. All right. But you got to do what you got to do. Life goes on and you kind of trudge forward. Now, the cards this week coming up, I always start that little video that go, it goes from Monday to Sunday. So the ones starting for tomorrow, they're very interesting for this coming week. We have a, a mixed bag going on. So be curious to see where we're headed with all of this. But October itself is a very interesting month. You still have, you know, the chance you can go look on YouTube. You can look on Instagram. And you can find my love and finance there. It is a subscription video, but it's available to everyone this month, and I highly suggest listening to it because there's a lot that's going on. And if you're feeling any kind of way and wondering, you know, where am I going? What is happening? Da 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 da. -da. And perhaps you've noticed this. All right, now like we've got the moon square Jupiter. All right, Capricorn is very responsible. Jupiter's in Aries, and I'm not calling, you know, Aries irresponsible. But Jupiter tends to be very, you know, social and, you know, wanting to be here, wanting to be there, and finding it hard to focus on one thing. But when you put these two together in a square, you kind of can get couch potato mode. You know, that just like wanting to indulge oneself. You know, it's like a good day to maybe Netflix and, you know, eat potato chips all day or something. I don't know. Whatever it is. There's a lot of good movies on the Disney Channel right now. So, yeah. Where I'm at, the weather will be bad. So, who knows? But me, I'm always working. But, you know, we all get days. We all get days where we know what we have to do. And, you know, there is that couch potato mode. The Hallmark Channel, maybe. No, they're not doing Christmas movies till the end of the month. But you get what I'm saying. It's just like sometimes, you know... No matter how heavy that load is that you have to carry. Do you really want to pick it up today? Do you really need to do it? I, Yeah. You know, there might be something going on there. And you just might not feel like it. And it's okay. Because tomorrow is another day. And every once in a while, you t need to take that load and set it down. And go do just that. Just be a couch potato. And let yourself relax. Indulge whatever it is you need to do until the energy passes and you feel like moving forward again. So remember, all those things, they'll still be there tomorrow. I want to thank you all very much for being here. I'll see you here again tomorrow. And as always, have a great day.